What's up guys? Welcome back. Today's workout is a 10 minute arms workout. We're going to cover delts, biceps, and triceps. We have four exercises we're going to do for 30 seconds each with a 10 second rest between each exercise and four rounds total. So grab your dumbbells and let's get started. Our first exercise is a tricep overhead extension. So grab both dumbbells for this one. Extend your shoulders so your arms are directly overhead and keep your elbows stationary as you bring your arms down behind you and then extend them so your elbows are straight again. Make sure that your elbows stay directly overhead and in towards the sides of your head. Don't let them flare outwards because that can cause extra pressure on your elbow joint. Keep your rib cage tucked in and your abs tight so that your back stays flat and doesn't arch. Awesome job, we have a short rest so we can transition to our next exercise, a front and lateral raise. Start by extending the dumbbells in front of you with your elbows straight. Then bring them down and extend them out to the sides. And repeat. When you bring the dumbbells out in front of you, make sure your rib cage stays tucked in and lean forward slightly. And this will just help you prevent from leaning backwards and arching your back. Also make sure that you're not locking your elbows, you want to keep them soft. Great job, next we're going to transition into a tricep kickback, so just one dumbbell at a time for this. Put the other arm on a raised surface and get in a lunge position. Bring your elbow up to the ceiling and kick it backwards, straightening it. Only your lower arm is moving in this exercise, everything else stays stationary. And make sure that your shoulders are even height from the ground, so nice and square. We're about halfway through, so go ahead and switch arms. Keeping your elbow up high toward the ceiling, straightening your arm, and then bending it. Shoulders and hips square. Great job with that. We have one last exercise. It's going to be a bicep curl. So grab both dumbbells again. Keep your elbows close to the sides of your body, but make sure you're not leveraging your arms against your body and curl up and down. Start with a neutral grip and as you raise the dumbbells, turn them so that your hands are facing upwards and then rotate them back whenever you lower. Keep your elbows in place, so don't bring them out to the sides or behind you. Awesome job with all of those, that's round one and we're starting again with the tricep overhead extension. So full extension of the shoulders, elbows directly overhead, rib cage tucked in with a nice flat back. Keep your elbows in towards the side of your face as you lower the dumbbells behind you and then straighten your elbows again. Good job, now going back into our front and lateral raise. As you raise the dumbbells up in front of you, lean forward slightly, keeping your rib cage tucked in so that your back stays straight. Then lower and bring them out to the side. Elbows are soft, not locked. Whenever you raise the dumbbells, pause for a second and then lower them. Take your time and make sure you're not using momentum to lift the dumbbells up. Great job getting back into our tricep kickback, so holding one dumbbell and putting the other hand on some elevated surface like a chair. Keep your shoulders and hips square and bring your elbow all the way up to the ceiling. You want to keep it there for the whole exercise, straightening and bending your elbow. Really feel the contraction of your tricep. Good job, we're halfway through, so now do it with the other arm. Elbow to the ceiling. Straighten and bend. Good job, and our last exercise is the bicep curl. So 
So again, keeping your elbows stationary, not flaring them out to the sides or bringing them behind you. Keep them straight and really feel the contraction of your bicep as you lift the dumbbells up and lower them. Switching from neutral grip to prone and then back to neutral as you lower. Awesome job, we're halfway through. We have two more sets of all of these exercises to go, starting with the tricep overhead extension again. Really squeeze your triceps together towards the sides of your face and tuck your rib cage in as much as you can. Keep your back flat. Great job, next getting into the front and lateral raise. Lean forward slightly and keep your ribs tucked as you raise the dumbbells up, pause for a half second, and then slowly lower. This is a slow and controlled movement, no momentum at all. I don't get anything done, you stuck on my mind. I keep on missing your touch, missing your vibe. This feeling I go when I say what we had. Great job. Next, getting into the tricep kickback. One hand on that elevated surface, keeping shoulders and hips square to the ground. Lift that elbow up as high as it can go and keep it there, straightening and bending. Great job, we're halfway through, so switch arms. And lastly, get ready for the bicep curl. Again, keeping your elbows stationary. Going from neutral grip to underhand as you raise them, and then back to neutral grip as you lower them. Awesome job, just one more round of each of these. Next up is tricep overhead extension. Last round, just remember to keep your ribs tucked and your tailbone tucked with a nice straight back, extending your elbows straight overhead and squeezing them together towards the sides of your face, raising and lowering the dumbbells. Good job, finished with that. Coming up to our last front and lateral raise. Raise to the front, leaning forward slightly, rib cage tucked, and shoulders back. Pause, slowly lower, and then raise out to the sides. Make sure you're raising them all the way up so that your arms are parallel to the ground. Great job, finished with that one. Next is our last set of tricep kickback. Make sure your elbow is all the way up to the ceiling the whole time and shoulders are square to the ground. Extend your arm fully and then bend. Switch to the other side. Elbow all the way up to the sky, extend, 
bend, shoulders square to the ground. Awesome job with that, we just have the bicep curl left to do. Going from neutral to prone, keeping your elbows down by your sides, but not leveraging against your sides. So don't dig your elbows into your body and really feel that contraction of your bicep. You're almost finished. Awesome job, that's it. We covered everything in this, the biceps, the triceps, and the shoulders. So keep doing this and your arms will get toned up in no time. If you'd like to see more videos like this, click that like button and subscribe to my channel. Hit the bell to be notified whenever I upload a new fitness video, and I'll see you next time.